How are you all and welcome back to another video of Potion Craft. Just join us, we left off, we had just finished making the Rubido, so we are all prepared now to start on the Life Salt, which is the final thing, I think, in the current content for the game. So after we've done that, we'll probably have to wait for an update. I'm not entirely sure what is in the Alchemist Pat on Chapter 7, but we'll see. Anyway. As always, we start off by going out to the garden, picking up all of our flowers, mushrooms, herbs, that kind of stuff. Make sure there's none hiding on the tree and then do our daily shopkeeping for the day. Insomnia and intense anxiety. Here's a sleeping potion for you. Just sell that. There's a guard that's making it really hard. I guess you also want a sleeping potion. You might be a bit short of ingredients. We used quite a lot the la to get this rubido crystal, but actually Chris, uh, we are short of um, crystals, so wouldn't mind seeing the dwarf fairly soon. Let's get right to business. I'm a great lover of women, but work stress. Anyway, when things got interested, I have problems. I presume it's a potion of libido this guy wants. I don't think this is a very common one, but we'll make a spare just in case. Put it right at the beginning, so it's the first thing people see when they come into the shop. Definitely haggling this one. Just like in real life, a lot of money to be made off, let's just say, non life threatening and issues. Okay, 550. I'm gonna dip my blade in your strongest potion. Ah, uh, and we had a good reputation for almost an entire episode. Okay, here's the mushroom man. Show me your goods. I'm not actually sure. sure. I'm not actually entirely sure. I've never, I don't think I've ever said no to that guy. So I don't know whether that makes your reputation go up or your popularity go down. Like it's supposed to go down six for refusing the customer. But if the customer is, let's say evil, does it still go down? Grave truffle, I'm pretty sure we don't need grave truffle. No, I'll just take everything else though. I don't think we use brown mushroom for much either. Three thousand eight hundred. That's okay. We can save some money with some astute haggling. One more pass, just to make sure it's a deal. Now we've leveled up. Do we have anything left to do? I don't think so. Just a bit of alchemy practice. Is this the one that shows up the green books? It is, yeah. Okay. A trap that makes trespassers stick to it and won't let them go. I'll make the trap mechanism, but I need a potion to make it sticky. Potion slow down, is that what you want? Apparently it is. I have some kind of rash on my arm. Do we have any healing potions? Not currently in stock, but it's alright. I'll just dip out back and whip you up. What are we short? We're short. What is this? Area. Hmm. Okay, only one. We're not going to keep this in stock. And the cutthroats is looking for me. Invisibility. We'll make a few of these. That's okay. We might have to make a new healing potion. Let's haggle. I need to get my money back after giving it all to the mushroom man. Okay, 735, not too bad. Apple trees just won't bear fruit. What do you want? Rich harvest? By fast growth or rich harvest? Can I make two of each? Okay. Just sell it. All right, so we are very short of terraria, it looks like. So hopefully we don't need any of that for the life salt. All right, that's the shopkeeping portion done for today. Let's start on the life salt recipe. We do need one. A lot of them seem to start with these, uh, what are they called? Health potions. We might leave them for another day. Let's try. Here's a necromancy potion. Two necromancy, two sleep and a health. Let's uh, check our map. I know necromancy is here. Where's sleep? Sleep is here. And the health is here. Two necromancy, two sleep, and one health. If we start with a necromancy potion, which we can't, are we out of crystals? Mm. 
What does this do? That goes across the left. This one goes across to the left. Across the left, across the right, across the left, and down. All right, so we could do a health to sleep and necromancy. It's probably the way to do it. Okay, we want to use stuff that we have lots of, like this one. Actually, we could make another health potion pretty easy by using these goblin shrooms. Pretty sure we only need one, just to make sure. Yeah, one health. One health to sleep. Or we get that first. Just gave it a mess up and I have to go back. There's one health, perfect. Now to sleep. What do we have to go across? Water balloons. We have anything slightly less common that goes across? Actually, not really. Not a whole lot of ways to go just across. Tangleweed, I guess. We have more water balloons though. I could use a shadow chantal, right? And then use a goblin mushroom. Is this a goblin mushroom? No, green mushroom. And with a little bit of water, I might make it. We only need a level two. Let's see how this goes. We'll zoom in a little bit. Stoke the fire a little bit so we're faster. Pick up all these green books, might as well. Okay, let's see if we can just get a level two. Nope. Let's try using a little bit of water. We should definitely get a level two of this, I want to talk. Yeah, there we go. Not too bad. And now, I wonder can we use two crystals? Where is this one to go down? just where it is. The ideal would be to get all the way into the necromancy using one crystal. Which crystal is it? Oh, all right. That goes up. Luckily, uh, despite myself, I have managed to salvage it. Crystal seems like a bit excessive, but we go. Well, I could try and go all the way around. Do we have? We don't really have stuff to go all the way around, do we? No, not really. Just use another crystal. Might have to spend some days just doing some shopkeeping in order to build up our supply of ingredients. There we go, level two necromancy. See if this recipe finish this potion. Let's go into our recipe and we want to start the life salt up here, I think. So I believe this is our Void Salt. Maybe we should use Void Salt more often. We never really use it. All right, let's start on the Life Salt. And that is this one here, this kind of spirally one. Not too bad, not too bad at all. Two Necromancy, one Heart, okay. Let's try Two charm, two heart, and a flight. Where is charm? A two charm, 
too hard and flight is I reckon if I start a flight go around to charm go down using plenty of water and then go to heart okay one flight one flight is all that's needed you make 28 of these then you grow from here it's perfect Okay, what have we got? Like, I could use a bit of white salt here, right? I just put this in. Go in some white salt. To get to about here. And then another one. That's pretty, yeah, that's pretty good. Should definitely use white salt more often. Red mushroom goes up, which is perfect. How many charm am I looking for? I'm pretty sure it's two charm. I don't know which one am I even doing? One flight, two charm, and two healing. This is almost good. Have we got anything else? Just this one. I think this actually might get me a level two with a bit of water. Speed it up. And I'm pretty sure the void salt recipe is pretty easy so we could just make more if we needed it. I wonder what it's stack. Like if we made another white salt would we get like 9,272 or would we have a 4,272 plus another 5,000? Anyway, let's see if we get some water out of this or if we get a level 2 out of this with a little bit of water. Doesn't look like it which is a bit unfortunate. Okay let's see what direction we want to take back. If we get to here, we could pretty much go straight back. So let's see, can we do that with, not with that. Let's try not throwing our ingredients around the shop. Do we have anything else? That's not good. Lava root, could do it. Finish just about there. Okay, there's our level two, that's fine. This is looking pretty good. Let's throw that in the way it is. I don't think we're going to need it. Looks like a pretty straight shoot. Yep. Let's use a mountain of water. Excellent, excellent. No, oh, that's the wrong thing. And now one of these and one more thing, and we should get this one without any bother whatsoever. Level two we need here, so we want Goblin Shroom is just perfect. That'll probably get us a level three actually if we tried. Don't want to get too good. Level two is all we need. Save that recipe, finish that potion. Add that recipe to the rest of our life salt recipes here head down shove it in our alchemy machine I'm really happy with that we used fight salt pretty effectively there this one should be fairly easy fast growth rich rich harvest and a healing let's see they're both okay there's fast growth rich harvest is over there to the left or to the right so I reckon if we go rich harvest, then we come back using a lot of water, we get the healing, and then we get the fast grow. Strong potion rich harvest uses a lot of these water balloons. No, let's use some terraria. I'm going to continue brewing from here. It's only use quite a lot of water. Let me just check, double check. Two rich harvest, two fast grow, and one healing. 
I reckon we want to use some of these. This might be enough to get me our one healing. Let's see where this line interacts. I think I'll get one healing out of this. Double check that is indeed one healing we need. It is, yes. And now we just need to get two. Just there. Should be easy. I reckon if we use some of these. Maybe a little more. One of these. And some water and something to go across. Not very much of that. So we'll see if we got anything else to go across. This with some water should do it. That's pretty good. Yep, here we go. Just a little bit more. Level 2. Very nice. I was just looking at his, and I was, for some reason I thought it was going to kick out two rich harvests, and I was thinking, how did I mess that up? But, turns out I didn't. Okay, doing pretty good. Pretty good. That was our potion. Where does this one go? Okay. Not so bad. These aren't too bad at all. Probably going to leave it there for today. We definitely need more ingredients, but it looks like we're knocking them out fast enough. I've definitely gotten better about moving around the ingredient map. We'll just throw that one in here. Why not? Sure why we why we have it. So knocked out a few today. And uh, I'll leave it there for today. We'll be back hopefully tomorrow or the next day with another episode of Potion Craft. Actually, I wonder would it be possible to finish Life Salt on day 50? That's a nice round number. So in our next episode, I might just do like a really long episode and try and knock off knives, uh, try and knock out Life Salt in one go. Which will probably take, might get it done in an hour. Definitely by an hour and a half, I reckon, as long as we have the ingredients. It could be fairly interesting if we didn't have the ingredients and then we'd have to use some fairly unique combinations to like instead of just what is it the one that goes down windroom is it that we, we ran out of i think it's windroom because it just goes straight down we'd have to go across to the right and then to the left just to go straight down could be quite entertaining but anyway so we might try and do that try and get the entire game or the life salt finished which i'm pretty sure is the last thing in this current content update done on day 50 which is a nice round number so you'll know next time you see a video for potion craft if it's an hour an hour and a half long you'll know that that's what we have actually decided to do anyway thanks for watching as always if you're enjoying it give it a like subscribe if you haven't already and uh, leave in the comments let me know what you're thinking of the series that's all for today take care of yourselves and cheers for now